is a T-Mobile Rebel 6 Pro smartphone. There's several ways to take a screenshot, but I'm going to show you two of the main ways and also how to do a scrolling screenshot. The most common way for a screenshot is a two key combination is the volume down button, power. Just press both buttons at the same time like this. And then from here, you can go ahead and you can share, you can edit. This right here will automatically disappear. All your screenshots get saved automatically into your photos app here. Just go there and go in your library and then you can see I have camera, movies, and screenshots, okay? So that last screenshot I just took is right there, okay? Second way to take a screenshot, if you have your assistant enabled. So I have my assistant enabled, so if I press and hold the power button, take a screenshot. Okay, taking a screenshot. Okay, and then I can just go ahead and close that out, go to my Photos app again, and that last one I just took is right here. Now let's do what's called a scrolling screenshot. So let's say, for example, we open up a browser here. We're on a website. And we want to take a screenshot of this, this one, this one, part of it, or all of it. Instead of doing multiple screenshots, we can do one screenshot. So for example, let's start right here. Let me go ahead and take a screenshot. Volume down power. And then you get capture down here. So if I tap on that, now I can go ahead and figure out how much I want of this page. Let's say I just want to go in the middle, right there, just like that. I just tap on save, and then this automatically gets saved into the Photos app as well. Tap on Photos app, and that last photo is right there, or that last screenshot, and you can see how big that one was. All right, pretty simple.